Yannick Sinner versus Yurila Hechka is the first quarter final for the men's Indian Wells for 2024. And both have had different roads to get to this stage. Well, Hechka started the tournament as the 32nd seed and would get a bye in the first round. In the second round, he'd take on the wild card Nakashima. And after dropping the first set, would fight back to win 3 6, 6 3, 6 4. Third round, he'd take on the number five seed Rublev, who had just taken out Andy Murray in the previous round. There's no problem for Lehechka getting to him straight 6 4, 6 4. In the fourth round, he'd take on the number 11 seed City Pass, who had just demolished Tiafo in the previous round. But again, no problem for Lehechka getting through in straights 6-2-6-4 to advance to the quarterfinals. Sinner entered the tournament as the number 3 seed and we'll get a buy in the first round. In the second round he take on Kokonakis. This is no problem getting through in straights 6-3-6-love. Six, six, Third round he take on the number 25 seed Struff who had just battled through Chorich saving match points in the previous rounds. This is no problem for Sinner getting through in straight sets 6-3-6-4. Six, six, in the fourth round he take on Shelton who had had two tough battles to get to this stage and after a close first set Sinner got through in straights 7-6-6-1 six, six, to advance to the quarterfinals. These two have actually never Never faced off before, which is kind of interesting because they have, you know, been around the same age. They're both 22 years old. They've been around the tour for a while. They did actually play in a challenger match way back when, where Sinner got the win, but that wasn't an official ATP match, and it's been so long since they have faced off, and also that was on clay. If is going to win this one, he needs to be super aggressive, and he just can't hold back. He did that against Sidney Pass successfully. He did that against Rublev successfully, but Sinner is a different breed at the moment. Also, he's a Grand Slam champion, so a totally different level of player to what he's played previously in this tournament. So he's got to go after it, Lehechka, come to the net and really put the pressure on Sinner. If Sinner's going to win this one, he needs to be a little cleaner than he was against Shelton. Against Shelton, he was a little bit messy. Maybe it's because of the wind and the conditions were a little bit brutal, but he's got to be clean and he's just got to push Lehechka around. He knows that he can outlast Lehechka if he goes the distance, if it, if it does go the distance in this one. Very fun matchup. Great to see Lehechka getting his shot at Yannick Sinner. He's been so good this week, but I've got to go with Sinner in straight sets. How do you not pick Sinner at the moment unless he plays one of the guys at the very top of the tree how do you pick against him it's so hard just to even get a challenger against Sinner at the moment and that includes some of those big guys so I'm going to Sinner in straight sets but let me know down in the comments below who do you think's making the semi